Hi, my name is Mark and welcome to my channel, The Media Nerd. Today's video, I'm going to go over this vintage Sears and Roebuck model number 9383 8mm film viewer. Now this is a regular 8 film viewer, it's not a Super 8. And I can tell you, you can find a ton of these on eBay that does Super 8, regular 8, or it can do dual. You can also find ones that actually have a splicer in it, so you can do your splicing right on the machine as well. Why would you want to use a film viewer to view your film? That's a very good question, and here's the answer. You find an old box of 8mm film from your family. You have no idea what's on it. And you just don't want to send off a bunch of film to get digitized by a person like me without knowing what's on it. This is a great way to be able to view your film, see exactly what's on it before you send it off. The first thing I want to go over are these black knobs. They move back and forth which makes it really compact to put in a box. They lock into place and then they screw right down so they don't move. On the back is where you put your film for eight millimeter. So you put your reel here and this is your take up reel right here. On the side of the viewer is the on off button and it just handles the light. There's no other working parts in here that's motorized. Now let's go over how to load the film. On the back, you put your reel and it'll slide right into place. Now you're going to want to put the film under this and through, there's a little metal piece, if you can see that, and the film is going to go up and through the top and then down into the sprocket right here. So let's go ahead and do that. Just gonna slide it right in, put it underneath, put it down underneath this, through here, and onto the take-up reel. It can now roll really easily back and forth. I'm gonna turn it on and reel it through so we can see a picture. This switch here goes back and forth. This is your focus control. Now let's turn the lights off so we can see if we can see a picture on this. Okay, you can see the picture really good. So if I just turn it slowly, it depends on the speed. There we go. So hey, there's little cousin Freddy and there's Uncle Jim. I really loved them growing up. And this is a reel that I want to be able to keep. Look, there's little Becky and there's little Jimmy going with their wheelbarrow. I used to have one of those. It's not a wheelbarrow, but you know what I mean. So I really want to keep this film and this is good to send off to a person to digitize it. I want to show you the, the focus switch. See how you can focus? Get a nice picture. Now basically you should be able just to rewind it to go back. So that is it. That is the basic operation of this vintage Sears and Roebuck 8mm film viewer. You can check out your film, see if it's worth digitizing. Maybe you don't have the equipment to digitize it, or you just don't have the time. I would love to be able to help you out. You can contact me at info at coloradospringsvideo.com or you can go to my website www.coloradospringsvideo.com. I have a page with an order form that you can fill out. You can specify all the different medias that you have to send to me. The email and the website is in the description of this video. So thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Make sure to subscribe, like, and ring that bell for future notifications. You have yourself a wonderful day.